Melissa, is soaking open from water or broth okay and adding a second protein, protein that's freeze dried as a topper? If you guys have watched any of my videos, um, you will know that there's a lot of things there that I would absolutely not do. Um, number one, well, number one, adding broth, broth is usually okay to anything. You can add broth to anything, um, even when they're on a therapeutic diet. A lot of those therapeutic diets, they've done testing and adding broth doesn't significantly alter the diet because it's the broth has very little nutrients. So it's usually less than 10%, which will not alter the diet. Um, so yeah, adding the broth is okay. Adding a second protein, um, just without the second part of your question, adding a second protein is a not useful, um, doesn't provide any nutri nutritional benefit. Um, B, it's going to unbalance the diet because now you already have a diet that is balanced. And I think open farm, like didn't score like great, but it's okay. Again, going back to that, it's not going to kill your pet. Is it optimized? No, it's not optimized, but it's fine. Um, but when you add that second protein, you take this diet that's already not E on optimization. You've added more protein. Now you've thrown the whack, the, it, you've thrown it all out of whack. The scales have become even farther unbalanced. So like if, let's see if I can do this. So if open parm was already kind of like e unbalanced based on the nutrients, and then you've added a bunch of protein, and we don't know how it interacts or how, you know, how nice they play together. Now you've really thrown it off. So I wouldn't do that. And I absolutely wouldn't do freeze dried because freeze dried is raw. Um, and freeze drying is just a preservation process. And so you've preserved the raw food. Once you've added that chicken broth or moisture to it, you've now reactivated the bacteria. That bacteria is in the bowl. It's getting stuck in the bowl. It's getting stuck in your dog's face and their fur, then they lick your face. And then you've got bacteria in your face, they go on your couch, your baby's on your couch, your pregnant friend comes over and now they're exposed to listeria. It's just a no for me.